you had no idea, today is the day that reckoning is served. A little backstory to the clan. Main Challenge was not originally called Main MC. Main Challenge it was originally called Cast. Cast was the first clan ever to use an in-depth ranking system, involving missions and things like that. Formula was there, but the luck was too unorganized for this sort of thing, so it faded away. Cast was also the first clan that became official on OA, according to the virus 329. Eventually, though, I learned that Cast was too long a name for a good clan. I figured out that Mudson also played and got together with him. I decided to change the name of Cast. No other clan in history at that point in time had changed names before. We, can, we became known as Mudson and Cast Starman. Not main challenge. Mudson and Cast Starman quickly became a popular clan, popular clan on OA. Attack, MC, and MB were all the biggest clans. Eventually, we got in a power struggle with the Conqueror, and I had decided to make the UC the most ambitious group of clans in an alliance. We quickly, we quickly became the big alliance. Um, MB was kicked out of the UC for various reasons. This caused tension. A war broke out. MC versus MB. Everyone sided with MC for various reasons. MC won the first WWB. World War Bear won. All was good. I had dropped out. I had dropped the idea of MC being called Mudson and Cast Scarman. Well, because it seemed a bit. I just can't find the right word for it. But you know what I mean. MC was just called MC for the longest time. The UC was good, but then small clans popped out everywhere. So many two to three man clans. A lot of one person clans too. The Conk hated it. I didn't. I was okay with it, but knowing that nearly all of them would die off after a week. But after that, more clans came in. The UC was going to declare war on small clans. I pulled MC out. I wanted nothing to do with this. And this next war was going to be fierce, and the biggest reason on why there became so many trolls on OA. I stood up with small clans. Small clans were like babies. They needed to be nurtured and cared for. These people didn't know how to run a clan. The all clans start small. All of them. World War Bear 2 started. Talk was made. It was it was the tribe of clans. I joined it, but they had a common goal as my clan. We attacked hard and fierce. We eventually won that war. It was then, because of that, trolls appeared. Out of nowhere, the very first troll was born into Oa. We fought it off, but like the flu, it came back harder. This time was more people. More and more and more trolls popped up. It began hard to work, but by this time, I learned of a name for the clan. Main challenge for the trolls was the main challenge we had to face. We are your main challenge. There's but one thing I keep in mind as I think of a way to expand the main challenge. A resurrected clan is a prelude to a fast and desolate clan. That is why the deathless clan MC strives to never die. The T died for it became too unorganized. MC would not follow in its footsteps. MC carved out a new set of steps. We know how to survive, even with the bare minimum. There is but one history of the clan no one knows about the struggles. This clan seemed to have faded away as time went on. Why? No one knows why. No one decided to join after I had migrated over to the Bear X fully for a long time. Mudson and I were literally the only active members for about most of the summer. Then in October, things changed. People started swarming into MC. No one can say for certain why, but the clan became strong enough to fight off some of the other big clans. People didn't like how I kept saying MC was the oldest living clan as a clincher to get new members to join MC. They hated it a lot because they couldn't say that. The tree died that month. It was formed about two to week, five weeks before MC2. I stated to all who hated my bragging. If you hate how much I say that, why don't you make the oldest living clan and tell me how it feels? People got really angry. Thus starting MC versus all. Well, not all. We had some of the nicer clans like BX on our side. In November, I could say another thing. MC is the longest living clan ever. My goal for MC ever since I formed it in January 2012 was to make it a year old. I never cared about being the oldest living clan. I always wanted to show to shadow the chief. But, I, but that ultimately failed as I needed to pave a new staircase for others to follow. LSSB attacked. None of those clans can claim to be the oldest, even if it is revived. Those clans died out and became reborn. How do you compensate for all that time gone? So it would be like saying one rotation of the earth is only 200 days because your clan was dead for 160 days and now you're you are reviving it. In December, we were full. We were in full anticipation. Just one more month until the biggest 
thing to happen since, well, the first clan was about to happen. The first day of main challenge. The first clan to be a year old living a full rotation around the Earth. My main challenge for main challenge finally completed. My last puzzle piece. I am whole. I now go for a new goal though, a new main challenge to live on and continue the legacy of the greatest mobile social platform ever, Open Faint. We aim for world domination. We aim to win. To win. We aim to conquer. We aim to strive. We aim to populate Battle Earth with the clan tag MC. We aim to have new members. We aim to be right the first time. We aim to continue. We aim to lighten up the world. We aim to help. We aim to bring clans back here. We aim to keep the young clans alive. We aim to get the headshot. We aim to live on 